To determine the mean number of children per household in a community, this person surveyed 20 families at a playground. For the 20 families surveyed, the mean number of children per household was 2.4. Which of the following must be true? Dangerous word. In A, we have the mean number of children per household in the community is 2.4. Possible, but I don't know if it must be true, but we're going to have another answer that helps us with that. In B, a determination about the mean number of children in, uh, per household should not be made because the sample size is too small. We're not expected to actually calculate like if the sample size is appropriate or not. In C, the sampling method is flawed and may produce a biased estimate. Well, how could our sampling method have been flawed? They surveyed families at a playground to see what the average amount of children per household is. That would be a biased place to go. If they actually wanted an average uh, amount of kids per house in a neighborhood, they would go to each house and ask them, not go to a place where predominantly people with kids are going to show up, which is going to give you like probably a higher uh, mean of children than what the actual community has. So it's definitely going to be our biased method here. In D, the sampling method is not flawed, so just the antonym of C. It's just going to be C here. 